Good day YouTube. Thanks for coming to my channel. Um, today we're taking a look at What Lies Beneath. Got it on VHS. Still plays great. It's uh, an old 2000 um, dramatic thriller with uh, supernatural undertones um, by Robert Zemeckis, the same guy who did uh, Back to the Future and uh, Romancing the Stone. And it stars uh, Michelle Pfeiffer and Harrison Ford. And this is a really different movie for Harrison Ford. Um, haven't seen him in anything quite like this before. So after a pretty bad car accident that damaged um, Claire Spencer, played by Michelle Pfeiffer, it damaged her uh, memory. Um, and her husband, played by Harrison Ford, Dr. Norman Spencer, moved to Vermont. And their daughter leaves for college, allowing the couple to compete with their neighbors and who can be the loudest in the sexual Olympics. Claire reminds Norman to leave the window open so everyone on their block can hear. But sexual Olympics are not the only thing that Claire hears next door. She peeks over their fence to witness the next door couple fighting, and at night she sees the husband putting a body bag in the trunk of their car. She suspects murder. Everyone thinks she's crazy because she's playing with Ouija boards and doing seances. And uh, she's starting to think that, too. She's starting to think that she's going crazy as too. As all this freaky stuff is happening, like doors opening on their own and closing on their own, and, um, spooky things happening in the bathroom, uh, or the bathtub filling on its own and seeing reflections or dead people in the in the water. She does find out, though, that her neighbor is okay, and um, the wife is still alive, and everything's fine. She was just away, and they were just having a domestic dispute or some sort, and that whole storyline is pushed out of, out of the way for uh, all this uh, supernatural investigation kind of stuff happening when um, Claire uh, finds like a lock of uh, this woman's hair, of this woman that went missing, and um, she finds out that this woman was uh, a student of her husband, Norman, when he was working at this university and he was uh, lecturing and had an affair with this uh, girl. Um, when she took the block of hair, the woman uh, possesses her in, um, in a situation where she's in control of um, Claire's body. She... Uh, gets intimate with Harrison Ford Norman and um, at this time Claire wakes up her mind wakes up and remembers that she caught the two of them and that resulted in her being uh, broken and just uh, very emotional and uh, that's how she got into a car accident and Claire's world is turned upside down when she finds out that Harrison Ford isn't the Indiana Jones that everybody thought he was. A sense shattering confrontation takes place, realizations are made, and truths are told, culminating in a crazy ending. I ain't going to tell you how it, how it goes. Yeah, and um, but it's a it's a pretty decent movie. Um, to tell you the truth, I've been just. Uh, I have all my movies listed and I put them through a, a program to pick out which one randomly that I'm going to do. And when I got this, I was like, oh, this, is, this isn't my usual fare. This isn't like a drive-in thing. And I'm not even sure if my v v VCR still works. But I was surprised. It was a good movie. It was nice uh, um, to see uh, Harrison Ford uh, expand his uh, acting powers. And it becomes something different than your usual good guy. Um, 
pretty w- recommended if you're into like thrillers with, mixed with uh, supernatural ghost stories. And it has some jump scares and tense drama. And I think it's uh, streaming on Disney Plus. So check it out. And thanks for watching. So this is a quick one. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.